if you, even if you didn't explore it yet, you will see it faintly. See, those are the ruins. See, Oblivion Gate close. Hmm. Ah, there it is. Yeah, we will not bother with it. We don't have a. Yeah, we will have a quest to close some Oblivion Gates. I am pretty sure I will not record this one. Oh, uh, that one. Definitely not, not, not the whole one. Might record. I might record the storyline, uh, the storyline of Oblivion Gates, such as we did in Kvatch. But I really don't want to. Do, uh, really don't want to do that with every Oblivion Gate, because uh, there's a lot of Oblivion Gates open. You need to close about five of them, six. Well, I believe each one in uh, each one in a different city or close to it. And and the final one, the big Oblivion Gate. I will not talk about that further because it's a storyline gate. And you might, if you didn't play the game, you might be surprised. But yeah, uh, there's a lot of Oblivion Gates you can close. You can get sigil stones. Uh, which you can use somehow, I don't exactly remember how. Uh, but the sigil stones help you, I'll show you. Uh, items. Yeah, you have the sigil stone in uh, your scrolls. And I believe you can either stick them to weapons or just use them. I'm not sure, I don't remember. Uh, I really can't say. Yeah, latent sigil stone. Absorb speed 15 for 30 seconds on strike, fortify 9 speed on self. Yeah, you can, you, you can, uh, you can get it to, a, you can, s bah, you can add it to a weapon. So yeah, that's, that's what the sigil stones are for. This one is actually really bad, but you will get, you will get some good ones uh, if you keep closing the gates. They are not, not uh, like super powerful. But uh, they are helpful. So let's go. Let's. Uh, we should be close, I believe. Show us the map. Uh, not so close. Not that close. Hey, do we have do we have the sodding moonwalk so I don't have to recast all the time? Ghost walk, yeah. Boom. Six, sixty minutes. Uh, uh, sixty minutes invisible. Sixty seconds invisibility. Ghost walk is awesome. Once we once we have a restoration leveled up a bit, then we will be able to use one of my spells. Should be the purple cloak. Uh, very short, very short speed boost, immense speed boost, and invisibility. It is based on the Morrowind scrolls, uh, the wind form. Unfortunately, you couldn't make you could you could never make a spell such as wind form, but you could uh, you well actually we found the scrolls in the in the LP, so yeah, we found this uh, was it called stormwalk, moonwalk, windwalk, I mean tempest walk. I don't know. <laughs> Crap. The terrain here is horrible. I don't even know if I'm rocking, walking the wrong, uh, the right way. Oh, why? Don't want to jump from this. Definitely not. Ah, there it is. Great. We are going the right way. There was no reason to go down. So now the necromancers can summon good skeletons. Fortunately, they cannot summon really go good uh, enemies like demons. But uh, I believe they will be summoning skeleton heroes, skeleton guardians, and all the nice stuff. Of course, we can summon, we can also summon that, but there is no reason to do so. We will summon the good stuff, the better stuff. But where's the entrance? Ah, yes. Ah, yes, reapers. So this is the entrance. We shall look around in case there is some stuff or chests. Hmm, Marauder Archer. What do you have? What are you wearing? Hmm. Not as good as I would like, but it seems he is alone. Let's check out the last level, the last floor. 
Yeah, there's nobody here, so let's deal with the Marauder Archer. What spells shall we need? This one, possibly. Sneak. Boo! That the best you can do? Yes. Why am I using this stupid attack? I have no idea. Hmm. That was weird. Ebony Bodo. Ebony arrows, we are taking those. Orkish boots, Orkish Kiris. I believe we will take the boots. I believe we don't have good boots. Let's see, we have Daedric Kiris and Steel Boots. And we're taking Orkish boots and leaving the Steel Boots. We want Daedric, but, well, that will take a while. Why are we so s Something's wrong. Oh, we are s uh, sneaking, yeah! That's why the attack was horrible. Was it? Yes, indeed. Problem solved. So, uh... I've arrived at Fort Ontos. I need to find Karania and get the Necromancer amulet from her. Indeed, I need to. So, let's go. Illusion magic is spells that can calm your enemies or give them a killing frenzy. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, frenzying your enemies uh, will actually make them attack y attack anybody around. I don't know. I actually never tried. If it did, it would be awesome. You don't look like a necromancer. You are a mage. What is a mage doing here? You better I? talk to Karania before you do anything else. Well, she's gone crazy. Ah, great. Let's heal. I smell trouble. Is that a mage? Or is that a black robe? Looks like a mage. How are you? Are you here about the amulet? Yes. Karania has it. All right. I believe she will go crazy. Mages always do. Power hungry bastards. How fare thee, friend? Yes, power hungry bastards. I said it. I'm a mage, so I know it. Uh, can we use the lockpicks? Yes, we can. Jewel necklace and crap, 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 crap squared. So is she here? Under streets. That could possibly be the one. Uh, do we have a green marker? Yes, green marker means that she is in the same location as you are. You are a mage, which means you are cool. This is a very hard gate. Which means we will need to unlock this. Yeah, you, you don't actually need to unlock this, I believe, but... Uh, we can, which means we will. Boo! Ha! What? Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, yeah, these gates are hard to unlock with magic. How fair these because uh, you cannot hit them actively, so it's kind of a big deal. So let's go this way. We have the Dremora, we have invisibility, we are saved, you are just the mage, but you have a chest. Potion of Grace, that you can, we can always sell that. Karania, oh my. What are you trying to do? As if it wasn't obvious. Well, well, this is quite a surprise. I thought you were Traven's lapdog, doing whatever he said. And yet, here you are. Good that you've finally seen the light. The cause will benefit from your assistance. You are a necromancer. What? You're here to take it back to Traven? Uh, yes. Oh, my dear, I'm afraid you're in over your head. I don't answer to Traven. I heed oh, only my. the word of Manimarko. 
When he has the amulet, his power will be increased and Traven will be helpless to stand in his way. You, I'm afraid, won't be standing at all. Hmm. I promise I'll make this quick. Boo. Unfortunately, I believe all the mages transformed into necromancers. Why are you... Yeah, deal with her. <laughs> Sucker. Necromancer's amulet. Fortify all power 14. Fortify intelligence 14. Fortify magicka 130. Drain 25 strength. Drain, drain 25 endurance. Great amulet. Unfortunately, I believe we will not be able to keep it. Karania was a traitor to the Mages Guild and intended to deliver the amulet to the King of the Worms. I need to get out of Fort Ontos and take the amulet back to the Arcane University. Indeed. We can loot this place. Mesmerizing Grasp, Scum Soldier, Ah, Strong Potion of Invisibility and Feather. We can use those always. Feather and Invisibility is always good. So now we can leave this place. And as you will see, everybody here is a necromancer. Unfortunately, necromancers don't usually carry carry good stuff right now. Let's check it out on this one. Boo! <laughs> so, glass dagger, necro ropes, and fort onto ski. Mm. Not as good as I would have liked. Unfortunately, for some reason, we are dealing very little sneak damage. Which means they are either resistant or two-handed claymore doesn't deal much. But I still believe that uh, uh, even, even the two-handed weapons should deal double damage from sneak. The possible problem might be that we are only... Are I am not here. That we are only be the beginner, the beginner in sneaking. So, yeah, that might be the big deal. Mm -hmm. Ooh, gate. Yeah, I'm totally lost. Hey, a chest. Good. Bah. Let's unlock this, let's try. Boo. Grand Soul Gem, that's nice. What? You scram. Oh Christ, this is bad. Am I supposed to be impressed? Yes, I'm invisible and I'm leaving. You are supposed to be impressed. Indeed you are. I don't even care about you. Boo. Suckers. Hmm, ah, that's the gate. Great. So, let's go back to the Arcane University. Uh, wait, no. We need the... We need the helmet. The Bloodworm helm, yeah. Fort Tele... Oh, Christ. Did they really have to go each to the... Everybody went somewhere else. So, Leavin seems to be the best place to start really yes yay this might take a while but I believe with ghost walk we might do it yeah I would I would have trained uh, restoration but it takes forever and with restoration this travel this traveling would have been, uh, would have been much easier because of Speed fortification. But the problem is, yeah, it's hard to train. It increases very slowly. So we might steal a horse. You wouldn't steal a handbag. Really? I don't think so. Oh yeah, horses. Crap. I totally forgot how to ride them. Oh. Uh, yeah. Did they check us? Did, do we have a bounty on our heads? No, great. Can you swim? Blah, blah, blah. Oops. I <laughs> think I broke the game. No. 
Oh crap. So slow. <laughs> okay, this might take a while. I will restart the recording after you get out of this lake. Yay, we're out. Let's continue with Grand Theft Horse. Dum -da -dum 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 -dum. Yeah, I usually find the uh, third person uh, to be better at riding. Third person camera. I wonder. Yeah. Ah, it did save. Hmm. Unfortunately, I'm totally confused as to where to go. Oh, yeah. Wrong way. This might still take a while. Yeah, this horse is one of the basic horses. You can get better ones. And actually the best horse you can get is the Shadow Mirror. Uh, which you will have if you finish the whole storyline of, uh, of the Dark Brotherhood. Which we might. And now you might see uh, an unfamiliar symbol to the north if you watch the compass. These symbols are Daedric Shrines. Same as in Morrowind. Uh, you will get a Daedric quest, uh, uh, you will get a quest from the Daedric Lord, and you will get a really good item if you finish it. And I believe a uh, spell, special effect. But compared to Morrowind items, uh, uh, compared to Morrowind Daedric Shrines, here I believe you need, uh, you need a special catalyst to talk to the Daedra. But it's not easy to guess which, to guess which one, because they usually have few followers. Which will tell you what you need. Uh, but these Daedric Shines are actually uh, easy to find most of the time. If you are if you are observant. Uh, but in Morrowind they were almost impossible to find some of them. Oh hey, a bandit. In glass armor. Bah, bah, bah. I really do care. Boo. No. Yeah, I was hoping we can uh, we can cast invisibility while <laughs> while riding a horse, which would be awesome. But it doesn't seem to be possible. We see a chalice. In front of us. I believe chalice is either a town or a stable. Possibly. Um, yeah, chalice is a stable. Dum de dum de dum de dum. Yeah, when you have a horse, you don't. Most of the time, you don't really need to be afraid of enemies, but you will not enjoy your travels as much. We. Hey, <laughs> this is really a bad horse. Ah, we should be close. We already see the fort on the map. Unfortunately, there is another. Uh... Wait, how do we leave this? Go home, my dear helper. So yeah, now we will need to be silent, but deadly. Special ops commencing. Oh yeah, we are close, 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 close. Do we see any enemies around? No, we still have very peaceful music. I doubt you can even hear that over the sound of my incessant talking smack. No, this is not the battle mage event I was talking about. Crap, I'm getting totally screwed. I don't remember anything. So, shall we get a marauder? No, but we shall get a skeleton champion. Skeleton champion is also good. By which I mean not good at all. So we don't want it. So where is the entrance? Ah yes, Reapers. This usually means that necromancers are abound, because there is a skeleton. Hide. I have arrived at Fort Telemann. I need to find Earl of Gerald, who should have the Bloodworm Helmet. Let's save. Let's continue. Oh my. An altar. Oh my god, a barrel. 
Oh, Christ. You guys again. It's been a while. The zombie, the Book of Daedra. Sneak skill increased, indeed. Boo! <laughs> Have fun. So, ah, but you have a staff, which means we can't leave you alive. Oh crap. Woo. Bastard. So he summoned a skeleton. We have a Daedra somewhere. Oh yeah, the Dremora. Boo. Ow! So did he kill him? We'll leave them to their fun. But I'm curious whether or not he killed him. Ah, he did. Great. So did he have a hidden staff? Nobody had potions of source. Uh, yeah, crap, crap, crap. Uh, for some reason, the frame rate tanked like great boo. Showing your face was the last mistake.